ratio of the number of chocolates Gaurav received to the number of chocolates Jay received is 2 is to 3. And that can also be written as 2 by 3. We have seen that 2 by 3 can be written in different ways. We can multiply the numerator as well as the denominator by 2 and get 4 by 6. Or we can also multiply the numerator and the denominator by 3 to get 6 by 9. All these three ratios have the same value. If we multiply the numerator and the denominator by the same value, the ratio remains unchanged. Even if we divide the numerator and the denominator by the same value, the ratio remains unchanged. Let's consider the ratio 12 by 18. We can divide the numerator as well as the denominator by 6. The numerator will be 12 by 6 and the denominator will be 18 by 6. 12 by 6 is 2 and 18 by 6 is 3. 12 by 18 and 2 by 3 are the same. 2 by 3 is called the simplest form. It means this cannot be reduced further. But how did we know what number we are supposed to divide them by? The number 6 is actually the highest common factor of the numerator and the denominator. If we divide the numerator as well as the denominator by their HCF, we get the simplest form. Say we have the ratio 30 by 50. Let's assume that we do not know what their HCF is. If we do not know what the HCF is, all we need to do is look for the common factors of the numerator and the denominator. 30 and 50 are both divisible by 2. So we divide the numerator as well as the denominator by 2. 30 divided by 2 is 15 and 50 divided by 2 is 25. If there are no common factors of the numerator and the denominator, it leaves us with the answer in the standard form. But 15 and 25 both have 5 as their common factor which tells us that this is not the simplest form. We divide the numerator as well as the denominator by 5. 15 divided by 5 is 3 and 25 divided by 5 is 5. The numbers 3 and 5 do not have any common factors apart from 1. So this is the standard form of the ratio 30 by 50. The product of all the numbers which we divided the numerators and the denominators by will be their HCF. Here, 2 times 5 which equals 10 is the HCF of 30 and 50. I would recommend you to first find the HCF and then divide the numerator and the denominator by just once instead of performing division several times.